Hey there everyone, this is Powerlight22 and I welcome back to I would to Let's Play Final Fantasy VI Return of Dark Sorcerer. I would say this would probably be the chapter one finale if the, if this game actually had chapters. Well, because it's the big mountain fight scene. And I was doing some testing between the last episode and now. And I'm gonna change my strategy a little bit. I was intending on beating everyone, like getting all the enemies, and being a completionist. However, in my timing, that took too darn long. Because I had three, two groups of three and one group of two. And I thought I divided the enemies, uh, divided the groups good, and I was winning, but I, it would take a long time. I'd have to heal, attack, heal, attack, and I wasn't getting anywhere, fa anywhere fast. So what I decided to do is I'm basically gonna have one party of four, put the other two other groups on top above our above uh right below Astral there, so just in case one group slips by have a chance of winning or a chance of surviving. And I'm basically gonna go right for the boss in this game. So here we go, shall we? I'm going to do that and here we go. So yep, I equipped everyone on I equipped everyone off screen. So basically, I'm gonna go through everyone here, see what they got. Fire rod. Uh, let's put. I don't want to put anything big on Aurora because she's actually not gonna be my main party. Actually, uh, how about we just get rid of the relic altogether and let's give her this crappier stuff. There we go. She has some stuff and some. Other stuff. There. Ark, he's also not going to be in my final group, so I'm going to remove his stuff. Going to move that. There is that. Saren. Move those stuff, because he's not going to be in my group. And yes, Cloud's not going to be in my group. I know. Can't believe it, eh? Cloud's not in my group. Because it's not part of my strategy. Yep, so basically, yeah, save states. Actually, I'm going to have multiple states here. Because, yeah. Okay. So my group at this point is going to be Oboro up top, Ronin, Avalon, and Tifa will be in my party. So, yeah, that's the way I'm going to do it. Here we go. Am I prepared? Yes. Form party. I pretty much go by HP. So right now, Avalon, Ronin, Oboro, and Tifa have some magic in there. And the other two people don't really matter. Cloud Aurora, Ark and Saren. There. Here we go. They're coming. Awesome music. From Final Fantasy 2 on the NES or Famicom. Remade. Crush those insects. Oh yeah? Okay, quickly move these in front and beside and go here. Now I'm set. Okay, I had to show you the music. Yeah, boom. give him the boomerang. Give him a Tai Chi cap too. Yeah, they're not moving when you're in the menus. Yeah, Tifa's not going to be attacking, so don't only, only bother with her too much. Now that we're going in, he's basically going to be using mostly abilities. Some attacking, depending. That's why there's so much front row uh, for those three. Alright, let's do it! Basically, go as fast as you can down.
Here we go. Yeah, basically a burrow steel. No, a burrow shurikens. I stand corrected. Avalon Havoc, Ronin Fire Dance, or the Phoenix, and Tifa as necessary heal support. Uh, their reels as needed. Yeah, don't multi-target Havoc. See, this goes very much easily with four people. I had that group of three, and like, I had Ronin, Avalon, and Aboro on one group, and they can hold their own, but, yeah. If I don't show all the other uh, groups here, sorry, I apologize, but this is the best way I know how to beat this little section. In this instance, I do agree really to use half against multi target, and hopefully, I can show it off as to why. Ouch. Darn it. I'll say those night rays have the ability that they can actually turn themselves into invisible. And in, uh, because they're, they're invisible, they are immune to physical attack. That's why abilities help. Darn it. And Avalon Havoc ability would make them invisible again. I'll take the HP boost. This should finish them off. Yep. Yep. Quickly heal up. I'm actually even better than I did last time. I actually want to show off a fighter to here. Here we go. New enemies. Well, new old enemies. Darn it. Yeah, I'll put all my clips in the video description when I upload this later. Darn it. Nice one, Tifa! Excellent. Ron leveled up, I'll take it. Yeah, I always hit X as quick as I can to go back to the menu, heal between fights. And because Ron is first, I'll put him in the front row now. There's everyone's stats. Now I've got a couple of enemies here, but I can get by them pretty quickly here now with this group of four. Doesn't hurt too much. Love when she wants up one shot them. Same with Avalon. See this group of four kicks ass. Ah, how many times I get unlucky with those reels?
I'm sorry if I'm a little quiet, I just kind of, I'm in awe of the music. Because I'm liking the arrangement for this, for this music here. Oh, almost, almost the end. Well, at least it shows off all the different enemies you can fight here. I think, I think that's all of them, most of them anyway. <laughs> really good here. Even with that, you don't stand a chance, Tech Mecha. I'm getting real good for the water kicks. Usually I'm going for the B rush. I'm gonna heal. Yes. Save state. Fight the mini boss here, Goliath. Steel. Nice. Chainmail. Excellent. That's what I was going for. Now just throw as usual. He should go down pretty easily. Now just a single target, I would just do a gale look on the right, right, down, left combo. I probably could put Cloud in there instead of Tifa, and probably could have got to do it faster, but oh well. Maybe not, because I like your real your reels. I should probably hear heal Tifa. Got him. That was actually pretty easy. Holy amulet. Very handy. I'll show you why in just a second. Holy amulet, which is right here. Nullifies petrify, sleep, and zombie status. Very, very handy. Not necessary for this particular part of the game, but for future parts, future areas, very handy. You're gonna want to find a couple of these if it's possible get your entire party with them. These two, try and find four of them, four of these eagle pendants. I'm thinking I'll buy them later. Anyway, if you go equip, she can equip the chain mail, same defense, but it reduces her magic defense and magic power, so don't bother on her. Don't bother on her borrow, because spoiler is leaving eventually. You can give her to Avalon, or Ronin. Because, basically at this point, it purely benefits Avalon, Speed increase, defense increase, magic defense increase, it goes to him by default. So, I'm all better now. And, boss time! Against Kefka himself. Ooh, new sprite! And he actually got minions! Aww, oh, what? I can actually. I used to steal them from him the first time. Let's try this again, shall we? Yeah, this fight actually works a bit differently compared to the uh, original where just Kefka one on one. Yeah, this one you really gotta keep your HP up. Got it. Now I'm happy.
Now, in this case, I would use my scrolls. Water, for example. I like the music here, too, by the way. Ouch. Yeah, make sure... Tiba is definitely be more for support here. Phew! Yeah, I'm in healing mode right now. Definitely gotta get the HP up. Okay. Haste. Avalon. Don't, I don't think I need to worry about that flying status, because I think, uh, because it's the magic ability, I think it avoids it. Nicely done, Avalon. Yeah, keep him healed. Not only to keep him alive, but to make sure that, uh... the Havoc is effective. Ouch. This isn't good. Oh, status exchanged. Not the worst thing. He actually changes forms. Well, kind of. He has another ally, Skaldir. I think the guy is actually from Final Fantasy and Mystic Quest. I know there's an enemy from called that in that game. I would just avoid him. Well, don't bother attacking him, I should say, because then the fight won't end until you actually beat Kefka. Hard to because the guy hits really hard. Darn it. I'll let you use an elixir on Yavalon because I want your health to get uh, to get higher. Yeah, let's go pizza. And elixir on Ronin. There we go. They get poisoned. Wow, well, I actually got rid of the haste. That's half impressive, if not sad. Well, it is sad. I got I do havoc. Almost got him. Well, at least you can't use it, we're confused. Well, that's good. Yeah, let's heal a Boro. I'll be almost done here. Ow.
got to rewind it here, sorry. Because, yeah, that was not the way I intended it to go. Yeah, I think that heals HP, ribeye. I hope it does. Yes. Reminding again, viewers. This is not how I was intending this fight to go. Man, this is not good. Rewind me again. <laughs> Sorry about this, viewers. This is not how I not how my test ones went. Let's do it. I gotta heal T I gotta attack Tifa. Come on! Well, at least he, the, other, the other guy's gone, so that actually helps. Okay, I'm still in this now. Still in this! Great. I still think I got this. Did I get him? Yes! Took a couple rewinds. <laughs> Not how I anticipated that. Got a Psycho Blade! Hooray! <laughs> we got him. Let's go get that Esper. Amazing.
Yep, as you can see, Aboro's gone. He kind of left. No! <laughs> Cloud actually fell off. <laughs> Poor Cloud. What? What's going on here? My thoughts exactly, Aurora. Yeah, get away from that thing. She's different. More like a demon than an Esper. Inter they, I think they kept the same sound effect. It, I'm not sure if that's just the emulator or just how that goes. So yeah, she's kind of going all over around the world now. Can't control her power. Flying everywhere. Going all over the world. All over. <laughs> Where the heck's she going? She's gone. Now we're back in Frost. And I think this is from Illusion of Gaia. There's music here, if I'm not mistaken. You have a small lump on your head. Haha. <laughs> Like what? An Esper? Hmm, maybe. Yeah, something strange indeed. Screaming across the sky to the east. So that's our next task, to find Aurora. Yeah, they need help here too. We gotta help her. Yep, so now we can leave some people behind. We gotta make our way to Castle Daventry. We'll make for Stardust Village and then head east toward Twilight Vista. So now, basically what's gonna happen here is... There are some cutscenes that are gonna happen, but you have to have certain party members in the group to actually do it. And I'm not 100% sure if I wanna keep them in my actual main party full time. So what I'm going to do here now is put Ronan, Saren, Tifa, and Cloud in my group. And these will be my party for maybe one episode. Then once that's done, I'm going to go, or maybe half an episode really. Once that's done, I'm going to go back here, I'm probably going to switch out. Probably, my honest opinion, probably Saren. And put Avalon in for him. But this is my group for now. And this is where I'm going to call it. So, 
Thanks for watching here, guys. This is La uh, Pilot 22, and thanks for watching the Final Fantasy VI with Dern Lock Sorcerer. Next episode, we'll make a way and continue with the story. Uh, thanks for watching, and have yourselves a good night. See ya. Bye.